Hey, what's good, everyone? So I'll show you guys the Demigod 6-8 point guard at NBA 2K24. Um, yeah, this is like a Jason Tatum build. It can do everything. It's like a two-way. It can shoot. It can play, mate. It can dribble. You got like it kind of plays more like a physical guard because you got that like Hall of Fame physical handles and stuff. It's not really too much of a finesse guard, but he can finesse a little bit. That's why I really like this build. It's definitely a very much like a Jason Tatum build. So as you <coughs> as you can see, sorry about my cough. First thing you want to do is go position point guard height six foot eight. Yeah, height six foot eight, weight two hundred and two pounds, and wingspan six foot ten. The weight is just enough to get that silver bulldozer, and the wingspan is just low enough so that you can get that silver um, what's it called, Agent Three, which is two really really good badges. Okay, fading and having that bulldozer is super super important. So as you can see, first thing we want to upgrade is our driving dunk to an eighty. Um, this is gonna give you, I think it's baseline clutch reverses or something it's going to give you one of the best dunk packages driving layup to a 65 as you can see it looks a uh, silver giant slayer but really the reason we need 65 layup is because it's just a cap for 85 ball handling and then same as shot close to a what was that 61 or 60 uh, we need that for our 90 mid-range shot which is our next thing so the first thing we want to upgrade really or second thing we want to upgrade is our mid-range shot to a 90. You can see the crazy shooting badges that this gives you, okay? You get things like Gold Space Creator, Gold Green Machine, Gold Guard Up. It gives you some of the best shooting badges, Gold Catch and Shoot, Gold Dead Eye especially. Um, yeah, I think Gold Dead Eye is the one that's actually unlocked on 90 mid-range. But you get Dead Eye, and you don't even have to have a ridiculous three ball. So that's really, really OP. And then three-point shot to an 86 will give you that Silver Agent 3, Silver Spot Finder. You also get Bronze Limitless Range. So this build can shoot, you know what I'm saying? Little fades to the corner are always deadly. Gold Corner Specialist plus um, Agent 3, Silver, is, is deadly, especially if you can time your, your, corner, th your corner fades. Um, free throw goes to a 69. A 71 would be nice, but there just wasn't enough attributes unless you downgrade the stamina. But I'm taking stamina over free throw. That's just my personal preference. Pass the accuracy to an 82. You get that silver relay passer. We don't have enough for um, bailout, which, you know what I'm saying, it is what it is. But 82 passing is more than good enough, okay? You'll be throwing dimes with 82 passing, so don't stress about that. 85 ball handler, you can see you get gold ankle breaker. But you also just get some of those good dribble animations. You can speed boost around and things of that nature. So 85 ball handling is really, really solid. 75 speed with ball, as you can see, that is the requirement for silver speed boost to hyperdrive and blow by, which are all your speed boosting badges. They're probably the most useful dribbling badges in the game, just because you can speed boost. So, um, yeah, that's why that's important. Interior defense, 61. Uh, yeah, that gives us bronze anchor as well as our block. So low key, this build has good interior defense, and then you can see we get 85 perimeter defense for silver clamps. Because we are a point guard, we're playing six foot eight, so we have good interior, solid interior defense. We have good perimeter defense, silver fast feed as well. Um, we get that 85 steel for silver glove, which is also really really nice. Silver interceptor as well, and right stick reaper. Combine that with your ankle braces and stuff like that, you can definitely get some steals and clamp and blob. 77 block, as I said, that's how you get your um, anchor. And then 40 defensive rebounds, just a requirement. 81 speed, as you can see, that unlocks that speed boost of silver and hyperdrive. Acceleration to a 73, unlocks fast feet and blow by silver. Um, and then strength, you can see we maxed that all the way out so that we get the lightest weight we can be as quick as possible, as well as having that silver bulldozer and Hall of Fame physical handles. We get silver immovable enforcer as well. So that's really, really nice. And then vertical, unfortunately, you know, we're gonna sacrifice some things. We don't get the best vertical. It is what it is. But um, 60 vertical is just enough to get chased down artist bronze, which is another really, really good badge that we need. And we also need 60 vertical for our 80 driving dunk. Um, and then stamina, we upgrade that to a 99. Handles for days, silver. Nine, uh, silver fast fit, 94 feet, sorry, silver workhorse. Stamina is just important, okay? If you want to play in the post, you need stamina. If you want to play defense, you need stamina. If you want to dribble, you need stamina. And this build kind of does it all. So <coughs> that's why it is what it is. Also, with that high strength, you can low-key post people up. 
and you can see you get shades of Lonzo, Drew Holiday, and Tyrese. Um, but we didn't go small forward. If we went small forward, we may have got Jason Tatum, but perimeter, I mean, putting your player at point guard is just better because then you can play the point. And realistically, Tatum plays the point more often than not. You know, he's bringing the ball up court. And you were in my career trying to grand, grind badges or you're playing pro and you with bots. You want to be in the point guard position. So that is really the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like, subscribe button. I really, really do appreciate it. Let me know what you guys think of the build in the comment section down below. And I'm out. See ya.